gift shop because I'm going to buy some really cool toys. My mom said I could buy as many toys as I want, as long as I have enough money. Hmm, let's see. I'll take the dog, the cat, the elephant, the robot, and a bag of toys. Are you sure you have enough money for all of these, Mr. Dinwoody? I'm totally sure. Okie dokie, then. Let's go pay for them at the Checkout Express. Oh, uh, okay. Beep. 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 That'll be three Puppetville dollars, please. Okay. Here you go. Your toys have now been purchased. Thank you for shopping at the Puppetville Toy Shop. Aw, oh, you're welcome. Come on, let's bring these toys home and put them in my new toy box. Okay, Mr. Dinwiddie, now that we're back home, are you ready to put your toys in your new toy box? Yep. Great. Miss Marionette, now my toys have a lovely home. You're welcome, Mr. Dinwiddie. Mr. Dinwiddie? Yeah, Mom? It's time for dinner. I ordered some Chinese food. <gasps> Chinese food? Yum! Coming, Mom! Magnificent! Ooh! Oh, awesome! This place is awesome! Ooh, this place is clown-tacular. Cool. Sizzling scepters. What a marvelous place. Wow, this place is worsome. Bust my blunderbuss. This is the most wonderful place I have ever seen in the whole of my life. Wow, this is a wonderful place. I like it a chock a lot. Whistacular. I have never seen a 
place like this before. What's this place anyway, Sir Sinjur? From the looks of it, I think we're in Mr. Dinwiddie's room. Mr. Dinwiddie's room? Does this mean we get to do whatever we want? Yes, Huff and Puff, it means we get to do whatever we want. Great! I'm so excited! Whoa! All right, guys. What do you want to do first? Hmm. Oh, oh. Want to see me puff up like a balloon? Of course. Okay, here I go. Wow, he's good, very good. Wow, he's simply marvelous. Wow. Uh-oh, I think Huff and Puff is headed for the ceiling. <gasps> Breathe out! Breathe out, Huff and Puff! Oh, um, okay. <sighs> Thanks, Brianna. That was a close one. I thought for sure I was going to hit my head on the ceiling. Hmm, I wonder if I can go higher when I'm outside. I don't know. Let's see. Ready, Huff and Puff? Yep, I'm ready. Wow, he's very, very good. Yes, indeed, Sir Sinjor. <gasps> Huff and Puff, watch out for the leaves. Did you say something, Sir Sinjor? I said, oops, too late. Puff McGuff. Sir Sinjor. What's the matter, Huff and Puff? Sir Sinjor, I believe that I might sneeze. Uh-oh. Brianna, you know what happens to Huff and Puff when he sneezes, don't you? Mm. He changes color? No. He disappears? No. His eyes get bigger? No. His trunk gets longer? No, look. Huh? Huh? Ah! Ah! Whoa, that was my biggest sneeze ever. Are you all right, Huff and Puff? I think so, Brianna. Sir Sindra, what happened? Well, when Huff and Puff sneezes, he lets go of his breath and he deflates. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. What? You mean every time I sneeze? Yes, Huff and Puff. Your big sneeze causes you to let go of your breath and deflate. Oh, now I understand. Aw, oh, Huff and Puff. Did the leaves make you sneeze? Mm-hmm. Aw. Do you need a tissue? Yes, Carla. 
Do you have one, Sir Sinjor? Of course I do. Here you go. Thank you. I'm not sure how to use this anyway. Oh, well, I'll show you. You do a soft, gentle blow, like this. Now you try it, Huff and Puff. Okay. Good job, Huff and Puff. Thanks, Sir Sinjor. Carla, what'll I do the next time I feel like I have to sneeze? The next time you feel like you have to sneeze, count to ten while I hold your trunk. Hold my trunk? Trust me, Huff and Puff. It always works. Okay. Good. Now I think we'd better go back inside. Good point, Carla. After all, I don't want anything else tickling my trunk. There's that toy soldier. Now's my chance. When I get to Mr. Dinwiddie's room, I will take him away, bring him to my lair, and melt him with my special melting solution. That way, Mr. Dinwiddie won't be able to play with him at all. wa ah 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 So, now that we're back inside, what do you want to do now? Hmm. Oh, I want to sing a song for all of you. Sounds good to me. What song are you going to sing, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star? The Octopus's Garden? The wheels on the bus? Nope. I'm going to be singing Lulu Skip to My Lou. Oh, I love that song. Me too. I bet all of you out there know how to sing Lulu Skip to My Lou. Let's sing it together, Robin style. One, two, three. Ronald. Thank you, Sir Sinjor. Gee, Ronald, I wonder if I can whistle too. Why don't you give it a try and find out, kiddo? Okay. Oh, I can't whistle yet, Ronald. Oh. Well, then maybe you need to find another way of making music. Great idea, Ronald. Do you know what I can use to make music? My trunk? Oh, yeah! I'm an elephant. I can use my trunk to make music. In fact, I'm going to play a song for you right now. You already know the song, Oh, What a Beautiful Day, right? Well, since it's the evening, the song I'm going to play for you is called, Oh, What a Beautiful Evening. So, here I go. Phew. Do I sound okay? Pufferific. I'm going to try.
try again, only this time everybody sing. Ready? Here we go. I want a beautiful evening. I want a beautiful night. I got a wonderful feeling. Everything will be all right. Let's sing it again. Oh, what a beautiful evening. Oh, what a beautiful night. I've got a wonderful feeling. Everything will be all right. One more time. Oh, what a beautiful evening. Oh, what a beautiful night. Really great too. What was that? It was me. That's what. It's Dazzle. You're so right, Hufflepuff. That's right. That's me. I've come to take your friend for a meltdown. You're coming with me, Mr. Soldier. Whoa! See you later, teeny weenies. Help me, guys! Help me! To Mount Puppetville, of course. That's where my lair is. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got some melting to do. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! This is terrible! We've got to get to Mount Puppetville and get Sir Sinjor back! I don't know, Carla. Dazzle's lair is the scariest place in all of Mount Puppetville. I don't want to go there. I just want to stay home. No, we can't, Huff and Puff. Sir Sinjor is our best friend. He needs us to rescue him. Oh, all right, Carla. We'll all go together. That's the spirit, Huff and Puff. Then what are we waiting for? Let's go. Mr. Dinwiddie. Mom, my toys have disappeared and I don't know where they are. Oh dear, Mr. Dinwiddie. Where was the last place you had them? They were right in my toy box. Oh, well can you show me? Sure. See, Mom? They were right here in my toy box, but now they're gone. Aww. Maybe you left them at one of your friends' houses. Why don't we check in each and every one of them? Okay. Wow, that's 
a really big mountain, Carla. I don't think we can climb all the way to the top of that. I'm sure we will, Huff and Puff. Achoo! But it's really dusty up there, Carla. Let's just go home. We can't go home, Huff and Puff. We have to get to the top of Mount Puppetville if we're going to rescue Sir Sinjor. All right. Let's go. Whoa, it's really dusty. I know, but look, we're almost at the top. I think we might be one step closer to rescuing Sir Sinjor. Perfect. Did you say something, Huff and Puff? Huff and Puff? Huh? Huh? <gasps> Whoa! Huff and Puff! Quick! After him! Huh? Huh? Achoo! Idea. Otto, you get behind Huff and Puff. You got it, Carla. Huh? Huh? Whoa! Now that was my biggest sneeze ever. Oh, Otto, you saved me. Thanks. You're welcome, Huff and Puff. So, what happened? Your big sneezes pushed you backwards down the mountain. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. Huh? Huh? Ah! Good tight, Huff and Puff. Thanks, Otto. Wait a minute. What does good tight mean? Oh, that means good health in German. It's what someone says when someone around them sneezes. Oh, now I understand. Uh-oh, I think I'm going to sneeze again. Huh? Huh? Oh, wait a minute. If I go backwards down the mountain, we'll never get to the top and we'll never be able to rescue Sir Sinjor. Maybe I need to turn around the other way. That way, my big sneezes will push me backwards up the mountain. Great idea, Huff and Puff. Okay, Huff and Puff, it's time for some tentacle tickles. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Huh? Huh? Achoo! It's working! I'm going up the mountain! Huh? Huh? All right! Way to go, Huff and Puff! Come on, Otto. We better get to the top, too. Yeah, let's go! Well, well, Mr. Soldier. 
I thought it might be a good idea to freeze you up before the meltdown. When I melt you, Mr. Dinwiddie will never ever see you again. <laughs> I hope the toys get here really soon. That snow sure is cold in this barrel. my blunderbuss. I think I must be getting a cold. Oh, if only Brianna were here, she would make me feel better. Nope, no toys there. Nope, not there. Nope, they're not in there. Let's go home. But we can't go home. Sir Sinjor's our friend. If we don't rescue him, he's gonna get melted. You're right, Carla. What I meant to say was, I'm scared. The dark tunnel is really scary. I'm scared too, Carla. I don't want to go in there. I want to go home. Whoa. Aw, I know you and Wilson are feeling scared, Huff and Puff, but I'll tell you what, why don't we all stay together in the tunnel? That's a great idea, Carla. Puff the guff. It sure is dark in here. <coughs> and really dusty. Uh, Carla, I think I'm gonna sneeze again. Remember what I told you. Count to ten while I hold your trunk. Great idea, Carla. Will you count to ten with me? You will? Great. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Huh? Huh? It worked. Thanks, Carla. Mwah! You're welcome, Huff and Puff. And thank you for your help, everyone. Whew. I'm glad I'm out of this barrel of freezing snow at last. Sir Sinjor! Huff and Puff. Oh, I'm so glad to see you in the other toys. I'm glad to see you, too. <laughs> Crumbling breadcrumbs. It's Dazzle. That's right. That's me. And now that my melting solution is ready, it's time for you to say goodbye to your soldier friend. Because it's melting time. <laughs> Whoa! 
Wah, ah, 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 Idea? Great. What is it? Oh, it involves Puppy mountain nuts. dust. Oh, mountain dust? Mm. Yeah. We were climbing up Mount Puppetville, oh, no, no. and then all of a sudden, really Puff and Puff got mountain dust up his trunk, mm. and then. Mm. This is terrible. Really, really What did he do? He sneezed. Yes, he definitely sneezed. So maybe if we put mountain dust up Puff and Puff's trunk, his we'll big sneezes will get the mountain dust out of his trunk, we'll and Dazzle will get covered in it. Him. Oh, no. Good idea, oh, Carla. Oh, dear, oh, dear. What will Mr. Ding Woody say to his friends when he finds out that Sir Sindra is gone? We'll never see him again! Carla, what are you doing? That feels funny. Don't put the... Mountain dust, curse you toys! Wait a minute, that's it! Carla, can you put mountain dust off my trunk again? I might be able to get Dazzle covered in mountain dust if you do. Of course, for me and Otto, for our friends, for Sir Sinjur, for Mr. Dinwiddie, I'll do it! Me too! You too, Otto? Perfect! Okay, Dazzle, eat my dust! Huh? Huh? Ah! Not my pants, too! Prepare to get sleepy dust in your eyes, Dazzle. Huh? Huh? Achoo! Ah! My eyes! I can't see anything! Oh no! No! Achoo! Whoa! I'm safe. I'm safe. You did it. You saved me. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Huff and Puff. You're welcome, Sir Sinjor. Ready to go home? Yep, I was born ready. All right. Come on, everybody. I know the perfect shortcut. But maybe things are not what they seem to be, Mr. Dinwiddie. Maybe sooner or later they'll show up. Why don't we go upstairs and see? Okay, Mom. <gasps> My toys! They're back in the toy box! You're right, Mom. They did show up sooner or later. See, I told you. Now, how about we go and have a nice hot bubble bath before bed? Sounds good to me. Can I have some lavender bubble bath, please? Sure, Mr. Dinwiddie.
good to be back home, Huff and Puff. It sure is, Carla. Huh? Huh? <gasps> Gesundheit, Huff and Puff. Thanks, Carla. Huff Puff McGuff, that was your biggest sneeze ever? No, that was my littlest sneeze ever. Oh, right. Oh, Brianna, I'm so glad I got plenty of exercise. All that running and mountain climbing has done me a world of good. Bust my blunderbuss. I'm so sorry, but I've got a dreadful tin soldier cold after being trapped in Dazzle's freezing barrel of snow for too long. will make you feel much better. I wish I may. I wish I might. I wish to make Sir Sinjur feel better. Are you feeling better now, Sir Sinjur? Yes, I'm feeling much better. Thanks, Brianna. You're a good friend. Aw, oh, you're welcome, Sir Sinjur. Okay, Mr. Dinwiddie. Bath time's over. It's time for bed. Boston, Mr. Dinwiddie's coming. It's time for us to go back to the toy box and you to go to bed. Good call, Carla. After all, Mr. Dinwiddie and I do need to get plenty of bed rest tonight. Thanks for coming to see us, everyone. We've had a great time with you. And you know something? You're the apple puff of my eye. We all love you very much. Will you be our friends? Pufferific! See you later, everybody! Bye! Bye-bye, everybody. So long. Bye-bye. See you later. See you, guys.